Yo, what is going on my beautiful people? Welcome back to a brand new video. In today's video, it's gonna be more of a vlog style video, so you already know what time it is. It's time to sit back, relax, and eat snacks. Let's go. So to start the morning off, I'm gonna be shipping out these Royal Ones. We had a little contest yesterday, and somebody won these for only $45. Dollars. Brand new Air Jordan 1 size 10. So if y'all would like to join something like this in the future, make sure you're following me on Instagram with your post notifications on. So this is going out to Tim. So Tim, congratulations on winning these Royals for only 45 bucks. <laughs> Like I said, today is more of a vlog style video, but I just wanted to tap in and ask everybody how are y'all doing? Are y'all feeling good? I'm kind of like trying to transition from summer into this kind of fall, winterish stage, and it's it, it just feels like something is missing. Like I feel like summer went by so fast and I miss doing so many things, but now like the days are getting a little bit shorter. It's starting to get a little bit more cool, so I'm still adjusting to it, but I just wanna check in. How are y'all doing, man? Yesterday I posted my cologne collection on my Instagram story, and a lot of you guys were DMing me saying like, yo, Alex, you gotta try this little Labo, you gotta try this Chanel, like all this stuff. So I love it when you guys give me recommendations, but what I really want is for y'all to share your Spotify playlist. So if you guys have anything like Don Tolliver vibes or Future Beano Blast, like those are the vibes I'm basically looking for. If y'all have any playlists that are very similar to that or you could put me onto some new artists, I would appreciate that. Cause I'm literally listening to music all day. So a lot of the playlists that I curate, those are like on repeat a lot. If you guys are interested in just checking out my Spotify, it's literally Sneakerhead in the Bay. If you wanna listen to my music, go ahead and uh, check that out i got i got playlists on there like tons of playlists but if you guys could link me your playlist i would greatly appreciate that lately i've been listening to a lot of messy marv mitchy slick jay stalin jacka all the classics so if you guys could just throw me some recommendations i would greatly appreciate it my music taste varies bro i, I literally listen to everything a few moments later i'm working on this special order right now for one of my customers Let's go. Ain't no telling what I do when I be talking to my demons. Nowadays we making money, stack that shit up to the ceiling. All the shit don't take the pain away, so searching for some healing. I got money on my mind, the only thing that keeps me breathing. I remember all the nights, all the nights that I didn't cry. So I just finished up these three eye patches for the homie. He actually lost his eye a few years back and he said he's been feeling really self-conscious about it and he couldn't find any eye patches that were super crazy like with the designs or anything cool. So he hit me up and he was like, bro, can you make me some eye patches that actually look sick? And I was like, bro, I got you. So we did the Gucci one, we did an MCM one and I'm blessing him with the Murakami one. This is different from what I usually make like the watch bands and keychains and stuff like that. But I'm sure if he's struggling, you know, finding eye patches or finding different patches that make him actually feel good about wearing it, I'm sure there's a lot of people that struggle with that as well. So I'm glad to help out the homie with this. I really appreciate him for hitting me up. So again, this is more of like a vlog where I'm showing you what I do on a normal basis, but this is just a quick project that I was working on. Okay, so we got a couple unboxings to do, but I'm gonna start off with the sneakers dub that I took. I haven't took a dub in so long. I'll even post what I got from, it was probably maybe like three, four years ago. I haven't been hitting, but as y'all know, the sneaker market, man, it's been a little bit different now. So it's a little bit easier to hit on things, which is perfect for the consumer, but a lot of resellers, they're hurting right now, especially when you're trying to resell retail kicks. So, what I do is I buy used shoes and older releases, so it's a little bit different, but hey, we got these for retail. As y'all could tell by the box, these are the Air Jordan 1 Yellow Toes, and these will be coming out the day that you see this video. So good luck to everybody. I hope y'all were able to get your pairs if you're going for these. I ended up getting a size 10 for the homie since I already had my early pair that I reviewed, but let's just check this out. I know the leather is going to be a little bit different on each pair, so let me just check this inspector for them, make sure everything is good, but man, I feel like this shoe, maybe three to four years ago, this shoe would have been at least 350 bucks, but it's cool that you could get these now for like, what, 200, 210, so not too bad, bro, not too bad for a nice quality sneaker, 
you can't complain with that. These things are beautiful. Yeah, so these are going straight to the homie. Again, I'm glad I hit it on sneakers. I just try for stuff sometimes when I'm like, man, I just feel like it's gonna hit, but it never really hits. But this one, this one hit. So it's cool that I was able to get these. But honestly, I can't really think of too many other shoes that are coming out in the next month or so that I'm gonna, you know, go crazy for. So but let me know what you guys think about these. If y'all haven't seen the full review, I do have a detailed one that will be linked down below in the description. I have wore mine a lot. I'm telling you a lot. Let me show y'all how much I wear these. So when I first purchased this for the review, I bought them maybe a month ago. So it's already been a month. Your boy was rocking them early, early. All dirty on the heel. These are so nice. I'm telling you, once you start wearing it, once you start seeing the creases, the leather softens up a little bit. They just feel like a nice shoe. I don't know how to explain it, but yeah, if you guys are on the fence about these, 10 out of 10, would highly recommend it. I also ended up getting a couple packages from Hibbit, so I figured, you know what? Let's go ahead and unbox those together as well. What's up, butters? What's up, girl? How you doing? You good? Okay, we got two packages here. We'll start off with this one. Ooh, what do we have inside? Hibbit sends me an outfit and a pair of shoes every single month just to post, so let's see what we got today. This feels very heavy, whatever this is. It might be a crew neck. Let's see. Wow. Wow. What the heck? That feels amazing. What is this? If y'all like this, you want to screenshot it, I think that's the style code right there. This crew neck feels a lot more heavy than a lot of the crew necks that I've had in the past. Lately, I've been liking, you know, more simple colors, just black, white, smaller logos, just keeping it really simple. So I'm glad that they sent this out. This is one that will definitely be getting worn a lot since it's starting to get a little bit colder now. But yeah, this is super nice. Shout out to Hibbit for sending this over. And then they also sent me a pair of sneakers. So let's go ahead and check the sneakers out. All right. Where is my handy dandy tool? Right here. All right, y'all. Let's 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 see what they sent me. It's like Christmas right now. Speaking of Christmas, Christmas is almost here, guys. Isn't that crazy? This year is basically done. We're coming up to the tail end of the year, so we gotta make every single day count. All right. Nike box. Boom! What is inside said Nike box? Oh, okay. We got some Air Max 90s. I'm pretty sure that they're going for maybe like a Halloween theme. That's what this shoe was screaming to me is like Halloween. We got black, we got orange, a little bit of white in there to break it up. So simple, simple and nice. I haven't wore a pair of Air Max 90s in a minute, so it's cool that they sent these out. I'll for sure be able to put an outfit together with these just cause they're so simple, like black, white, a little bit of orange in there, and you can't go wrong with the Air Max 90 silhouette. Huge shout out to Hibbit Sports for keeping your boy fresh. I really appreciate it. This is not paid, this is not sponsored or anything, but they do just send me some sneakers and some clothes every now and then, which I'm very grateful for, so thank you guys. And also thank you guys for watching these videos. These companies hit me up because of y'all, so I appreciate you guys for watching. But anyways, I'm gonna let you guys go. I gotta edit this video to make sure it's out tomorrow for y'all. If you guys have any crazy plans this weekend, I hope y'all stay safe, stay blessed out there, and I'll see you guys very soon for the next video. It's your boy Sneakerhead in the Bay. I'm out. Peace.